Hello, welcome to my channel, InFlight Music. If you're new here, my name is Ian, and today I wanna to go over some free plugins and software tools for music producers during our quarantine. So over the past month, a few companies have come out to help producers during their time of isolation. I know for the most part, a lot of music producers are usually more introverted anyway, so a lot of them are used to the whole idea of isolation. But now's a great time to take advantage of it because a lot of these companies are releasing free products or temporarily free products just to keep you busy during the quarantine times. So starting with Arturia, they're actually letting you use the complete version of Analog Lab and Pigments completely for free for months. So from now until July 3rd of 2020, you can pick up Analog Lab and you can pick up Arturia Pigments as well. I do, I definitely do recommend getting both because they actually interact with each other. If you're not familiar with the V Collection and what Arturia does with their Analog Lab software, this is basically a preset player with some control over the presets with these knobs and sliders here. And the presets are based off of their flagship synthesizers. So for example, Arturia Pigments, as soon as you buy the full version or get the full version of any of their synthesizer plugins, you'll be able to access all of their presets and all of the parameters inside of those plugins, all through Analog Lab. So again, that's until July 3rd. Some of you might have noticed this big banner right here in the middle saying until May 7th with 50% off. I will have links in the description below for all the free stuff and all the discounts. I do get a little bit of a kickback if you use those links, specifically the ones from Plugin Boutique. But you can see here all their individual plugins, even their effects, not just their synthesizers, are 50% off. They have compressors, delays, filters. That's actually what I just bought. I just bought the SEM filter. And of course, their synthesizers, Analog Lab, so on and so forth. Ah, and here's the SEM filter. I just bought this. Um, I'll definitely do a tutorial on it because I'm pretty sure that I use it way different from everyone else. If you've seen any of my previous sound design tutorials, you know that I am absolutely obsessed with filters. I'll judge a synth more on their filters than their oscillators. And just having a dedicated filter like the SEM filter or the M12 or the mini filter, all three sound completely different. I definitely do plan on getting all three. At 50 bucks each, you would get the collection for 150. Normally it's 200 bucks. A lot of you should be familiar with Sound Toys and they're actually offering their entire effect rack for free until June 30th. And I'm just now realizing that this says that the offer ends April 28th, which is actually today. So I apologize for not getting this video out sooner. I'm actually recording this on the 28th. I actually wanna send them a message and see if they wanna extend this for one additional week. Now, normally I would assume not, but because I really wanna help you guys out, if they know that I'm making a video on this and trying to spread this a little bit further, maybe they'll change their mind. Send message. Now, I really don't think that that'll change anything, but it doesn't hurt to try. But their effect rack includes Echo Boy, Primal Tap, Decapitator, Radiator, Tremolator, Filter Freak, so on and so forth. So all of their main plugins that people know them for, those are available in the effect rack. So again, I'll go ahead and post this video today so that you guys can try to take advantage of that. Ableton is another company that's doing the whole free for X amount of days. This one goes on for 90 days. So a lot of these companies are sticking with the three months free idea or the three months free range. Comment down below if you want me to pick up Ableton and try it out for 90 days and just start dropping some videos on Ableton versus FL Studio, and I'll definitely do so. It won't be a direct Ableton versus FL Studio, but it will definitely be videos based off of an FL Studio user trying to transition to Ableton for the first time. So that might be interesting for you guys. But not only are they doing the free for 90 days, they also did a price drop. Normally Ableton, the version that I would get is right around 500 bucks. It says 450 right here. Right now you could pick it up for 314 and now their sweet version, their highest version is 524 bucks. So right around 500 bucks. The difference is you get a lot more samples, quite a bit more uh, software and effects, but the ones that this one comes with already, if you're someone that already has a good plugin collection, like myself, I really wouldn't worry about the extra audio effects and instruments that they give you or the samples because those really are extra compared to what you get here. But speaking of DAWs, here's a free one. So Serato is known for their DJing 
software, really their ability to manipulate samples because they have a new plugin called Serato Sample, I believe. And that one is probably the best plugin you could buy in terms of manipulating samples. But now they have an entire studio. So there is a subscription model where you could cancel at any time. It has advanced features, sound packs, and then you could outright buy the entire thing for 200 bucks. So in the free version, you're limited to one audio track. I think that's the main thing that really stands out to me. So basically you would be using the free version to manipulate an individual sample and then bring that back into your main DAW. That's how I would personally use it, especially seeing that it only works with MP3s versus the paid version works with everything. And here's another DAW with another 90 day free trial. If any of you are on Mac, you could get Apple Logic Pro 10 and Final Cut Pro 10 on your Mac free for 90 days. That way you get an idea of whether or not you want to use that software. I really don't have much else to say about it other than, hey, it's free for 90 days. For anyone making hip hop or trap, definitely check out this sample pack. I just downloaded it. Comment down below if you want to see me make a beat using only the samples from this sample pack, but listening to the demo, it sounded pretty good. So a lot of variety in this pack for sure, but it's almost two gigs worth of samples. So, so there should be plenty in there for you to play around with. Speaking of samples, this was just updated two weeks ago. If any of you are going through multiple sample packs on all different various websites, well, here's one page, 70,114 free sample downloads from A to Z. So you'll never be able to go through all these samples. So, so this one site alone, you're never going to run out of samples to download. Now, of course, the quality of these are going to range from not that great to amazing. Why aren't you selling this? But considering all it takes is just a click of a button and all of a sudden you have the sample pack to try it out yourself. I think this is a great resource for you guys. So one of my favorite music companies of all time, Roland, they're actually doing free online piano lessons from Roland and Scoov. They're offering three free months of piano lessons for free. So I think this is a great way to get started in figuring out how to use your instrument. If any of you have MIDI controllers, but you don't really even know how to play the keys. So I did a little more research into Scoov. And not only do you get those three free months, so they have 27 songs that are now available for free. You got Lean On Me, We Will Rock You, some Beethoven, Ed Sheeran, Megan Trainer, All About the Bass, that's interesting. Beach Boys, The Coexistence. I didn't know that they were called The Coexistence until my friend, whose name is actually Angelica, I used to call her Angel, told me that this band is actually called The Coexistence and not The XX. <laughs> embarrassing story. But anyway, The Police, Every Breath You Take. Some of you might recognize the Diddy version that he did after Biggie passed away. The James Bond theme, Elton John, Rocket Man, classic. Coldplay, The Scientist. That's something that I taught myself on piano. Beethoven, Fear Elise. So a couple Beethovens, even a Mozart Sonata number 11 in here. So a huge range of different songs here for you to learn on piano. So that about wraps it up for me. Let me know if there's any tutorials that you want me to do based off of what I showed you here today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.